let's now add some software to the system so here is my option for all the softwares if i click on engineering software it shows me step 7 step 7 15.5 you can see this ti portal and this is a combination license so what that means it is combination for ti portal and the older step 7 version 5 same thing WinCC, WinCC Flex 2008, or if we need SCADA software, WinCC 7X. We have different runtime options. We have Cymatic Net, and then if you need some planning simulation software and then migration services, so I'm going to select on engineering software. So let's go ahead and look at TI Portal because we don't need a combo. Everything is done in TI Portal. What kind of PLCs we have? We have 1200 and 1500. So let's say if I just select 1200 for a second and I say no, I don't have a safety CPU and I'm not using the software, then I need step seven software. And do I want to download or a package DVD? I want a DVD shipped to me so that I can have the installation medium. And then SUS is the software update service, which is a one year subscription. So let's say right now the software is version 15 and within one year Siemens releases version 16, I automatically get a free copy and an upgrade license for 16. So I always add this as an SUS download that comes directly to your email. Uh, as you can see, it shows me step seven basic package. Now if I select 1500 on it, it changed it to professional. So I have all my options. If I need any engineering different options for runtime, like the OPC UA, I have options for multi-user, cloud connectors, Steam Gateway, uh, Safety, PLC Advance, Energy Suite, and then user management components. But I'm not going to add anything. I just want to show you the ProDiag for Advanced Diagnostic, OPC UA, Runtime for Energy Suite, and then Energy Monitoring. Let's go ahead and add, sorry, add a new software. And this time we will add WinCC, so WinCC version 15. Same thing, configure, whether we have basic panels, configure engineering options. No, I'm not using it. And I want a package DVD, step seven basic. If I select comfort panels, I have comfort. If I want machine level, which is runtime advance, then I have the WinCC advance. Now we don't have a PC base, so we'll just leave it to comfort panels. And then what kind of SUS, we'll do downloads. There's also options for comfort panels. So if I go to the runtime, there's an option for smart server. Note with version 15, you don't need it for the comfort panel. It's only for basic panel. There is WinCC audit license, which is nice for all the FDA requirements. This is a nice add-on. And the same pro diag if you have a pro diag on there. And then what kind of download or package DVD we want. I'm going to go back and just remove the option so that everything is green. Make sure this is green. So here's all my parts list. So if I go to my order list, here are what my switches. And here is my step 7 and WinCC. So now I can export the whole list. Export. And I can do a PDF or Excel. I'm going to Excel and the other selection tool, parts list, I'm going to save it. And now I will have a complete POM for my system.